Hi everybody, we've done it for a change in costs, now let's do it for a change in revenue. So if revenue for a firm changes, how do we illustrate that diagrammatically? Well, of course, here we're going to be shifting revenue curves. Now, there are two ways that you can actually do this. One way is that maybe you're given data. You're given data that a firm's total revenue, ARMR, has increased or decreased. Well, of course, there you can then show that by shifting revenue curves. Or you can link the revenue curves for a firm to demand because we know that average revenue is the demand curve for a firm. So when demand changes, demand increases or decreases for whatever reason, you can illustrate that by shifting your revenue curves, remembering that your revenue curves are basically demand curves. Um, so yes, let's take an example of revenue increasing or demand increasing for a firm. How would you show that? You would show that by shifting these revenue curves to the right. If revenue were to fall or if demand was to decrease, you would shift these curves to the left. So in this case, revenue is increasing or demand is increasing for whatever reason. Shift these curves right and let's see what the end outcomes are. Before we shift, just remember our basic process because this diagram is going to look a little bit messy at the end. So always we go profit max, MC equals MR. That's where Q1 comes from originally. We read the price of the AR curves where P1 comes from. At the profit max quantity, we compare AR and AC for the profit per unit. So A is AR, B is AC, so it's super normal profit per unit multiplied by Q1 to get this box. Here we go with the shifts. So shifting AR and then MR. So AR first, a nice big shift of AR over there. Let's call that AR2, which is now D2. MR is twice as steep. So MR twice as steep, call that MR2. A lot has changed here. So now there is a new profit max point where MR equals MC. That gives us a quantity. Let's call that quantity Q2. We read the price of the new AR curve. So go up to the new AR curve to get the price. So let's call that P2. So we can see that quantity is increased. Price is increased, just like when demand shifts right in a normal market. We expect to see that. Let's work out the profit per unit. Let's compare AR and AC at the profit max quantity of Q2. Well, AR is now over here. Let's call that point D. And AC, we need to go all the way down here to find AC, which is point E. So D is AR, E is AC, AR is significantly greater than AC. This again is super normal profit per unit. We need to multiply that by all of Q2 to get the total profit. So let's stretch that across. Let's call this point C2. So our new super normal profit box is going to be the box P2, D, E, C2. It's significantly higher box than it was before. So it's very clear to see that with an increase in demand, an increase in revenue, that price has increased, quantity has also increased, and profit has increased, just like you'd expect to see when demand shifts to the right. If revenue reduces and demand shifts left, so AR, MR shift left, it's going to be the opposite impact. Price will fall, quantity will fall, and profit will decrease. We don't need to worry about total revenue, a bit like on the last video. We don't really draw TR curves. Of course, if you're drawing TR, you can apply the same concept of shifting there. So shifting upwards with revenue, total revenue curves, but we tend not to draw it just like with cost curves. We don't tend to draw TC. It's AR and MR that we tend to focus on with the shift. So there you have it, guys. Revenue curve shifts for you. This is one way shifting right. You can do the same exercise with these curves shifting left. Make sure you're comfortable with it. Looks funky at the end, but you're following the same process. That's the key with getting these diagrams right. Great to add this to your arsenal. Great to whip it out if you're showing a change in a firm's revenue or a change in demand for a firm. Fantastic that you watch this video. Can't wait to see you in future ones.